In what was a terrible but typical first preseason game, there were three interesting takeaways. The first was Mason Mount. If I was Mount, I would be worried. Ten Hag played him centre midfield, the position Ten Hag brought him to play in, but blew up in his face inside two games when it became apparent that Fernandes and Mount in midfield completely exposed Casemiro and United's backline. With the vast majority of United's first team squad unavailable, for Mount to see youngsters and Rashford playing in his preferred positions is a massive blow for him. Unless there are injuries, in my opinion, Ten Hag has shown his hand that Mount is unlikely to start matches next season. The second is Fitek. It was a great performance from the young goalkeeper. He made a number of noticeable saves, which nearly kept United's clean sheet. On top of this, he seemed comfortable on the ball, both with his control and distribution. To be balanced, he wasn't put under much pressure, but in this example he was and played a very good pass. But if we combine this performance with the nightmare by India had at the Euros, Vitek has put himself at the front of Ten Hag's mind as a possible number two next season. The final takeaway comes in two parts. The first is Toby Collier. A couple of you mentioned him in the comments as your favourite youth team player. As you can see, he is a unit. Big guy with a strong physical presence. He is capable of showing for the ball in these deep positions under pressure and works hard without the ball. He is definitely a no-thrills anchor man, which is exactly the sort of player that succeeds in the game today. Will that be at United? Who knows? But he was one of the players that put his hand up in the game and it was nice to see. The second part of the final takeaway is Ethan Ennis. He made headlines by leaving Liverpool to join United and has gone under the radar since. But he had three explosive runs in the game that took me by surprise. The pace, power and close control he showed impressed me and could buy him some more game time against Rangers. Good or bad, let me know what stood out in the game for you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.